There are certain elements in any economic system that provides checks and balances for our behaviors. People generally do what the system allows them to do. Our economy right now is very, very informal. It's extremely informal, so people can really hide in this economy. You, you are not uniquely identified. Your addresses are not known. So we don't have a national ID so which uniquely identifies everybody. And you don't have a unique address. Many economies cannot function without these major prerequisites. So we are saying that no, we have to chart a new course. Beginning this year, we are going to bring into place in Ghana, and it will help us a lot to build a system that will channel our behavior more than along the lines of ethical lines. First of all, by the grace of God, we are going to put in place, this starting this year, the National Identification System for Ghana. This is very, very important. Uh, so that everybody will be uniquely identified. And we expect to, to start delivering this project by the third quarter of this year. We are trying, uh, and over the years, street naming and all of that. But there is really been a major problem uniquely identifying every pro property in Ghana. And this has taken us since independence, 60 years on, we are still struggling with it. We have come into office, Nana Kufuado has given us the charge to make sure that by the end of this year, we implement a unique addressing system in Ghana where every property can have a unique address. To do this, we have to use technology. We have to get into the realm of ICT, which allows us to do digital mapping and digital addressing. So Ghana has opted to adopt a digital addressing system, which with the help of all of our, our Google Maps and so on, we are going to be able to identify every property uniquely. It is already pretty much on the way. And by, um, we are hoping that by the end of the day, this year, it will be done, but the task that we have really given to people who are working on this is we want this to start in July this year.